We are an in-person business. We made the decision to open a brick and mortar bookstore, which a lot of people think is crazy in this sort of online age because we wanted people to be able to have an actual physical space. And now we've lost that. We are one of the only romance-focused bookstores in the Northern Hemisphere. We both just really responded really strongly to the idea that people's emotional inner lives were, were of a, a level of importance that you could devote a whole book to it. The first week, it was pretty much damage control and honestly, like starting a new business. we developed this care package system that's designed to basically let people still get bookseller recommendations, which is what, in my opinion, we, we do a good job of. You can tell us about your taste and things you've liked and things you haven't liked. This person says, I'm a historical junkie with a preference for excellent writing, extra points for wit, no shapeshifters or wear lovers if you please. there's options to add a candle or you can add a bookmark. In this case, our person has selected surprise me with something worth $10. So for our $10 people, I have been doing um, socks. And then people have really been writing really nice notes. Like Julie says, I hope you guys are holding steady and not tearing your own bodice unless you want to these days. I'm rooting for you, XOXO. It's small, but it, it really, helps me to feel like at least I'm making somebody happy. We had our Queer Book Club online this weekend. It went okay. We still wanna help authors promote their books. The minute basically this started, our manager said to me, well, we're gonna see the return of the paranormal in a year and a half because she was saying that no one was gonna wanna read like straight contemporaries because you either have to eliminate this period of history or like include it. The thing that works the best for me, focusing on, on why I'm doing this, and um, in this instance, it's to be able to pay my employees. And in order to do that, you need to bring in money. And then I've never been very good at this, but now is a great time to practice being nice to yourself.